Computer network communication works using software ports. Viruses and hackers use open ports in the operating system to have illegal access to the system. The simplest way to stop hackers from connecting to your computer is to close all the opened ports. But this means that all your network communication will come to a halt. The solution to this problem is that you should only open those ports which are needed by the running applications in your computer. For example, if you are using an SSH client, you should open port 22 for the application to communicate. In this video, we will discuss how to open or close the TCP and UDP ports in Windows for better security and control over your computer. This video applies to all Windows which have Windows Firewall enabled. To open or close a port in Windows 10, go to Windows Defender Firewall with Advanced Security. On the left-hand pane, click on Inbound Rules. You will see a list of rules that have already been made by Windows Firewall. To create a new rule, click on New Rule in the right-hand pane. You will need to select the type of rule that needs to be created. The options include Program, Port, Predefined and Custom. Since we are opening or closing a port, we will select the type as port. On the next screen, you will get an option to select the port type as TCP or UDP. Most of the times, TCP is the port type that we will need to select. In the next step, you will need to select whether this rule should apply to all local ports or specific ports. You can specify a port number if you want the rule to be applied on a specific port. On the next screen, you will actually make the rules. The rules include allow the connection, allow the connection if it is secure and block the connection. If you want to open the port, you will need to select the first option and if you want to close a port, you will need to select the last option. On the next screen, you will get an option to apply the rule on specific network types like domain, private or public. In the last step, just give a name to your rule and press the finish button. If you want to see which ports are currently open in your computer, you can use the command netstat from command prompt. This command will display all the open ports in Windows. Kerports is a utility which can display open ports in graphical user interface which can be better understood by the user. I hope this tutorial will help you in configuring your Windows firewall better and I'd like to thank you for watching. Any comments and suggestions are always welcome.